Hey, welcome into another edition of MAM 101. Now, this spring in Denver, we got a ton of snow, just a boatload. And I'll tell you, there's very few things that are more satisfying when you're a dude than to fire up that snow thrower and just throw snow all over the place, right? Clear off the pool decks, give the dogs the free run of the backyard. Meanwhile, you're driving around that thing and you're just watching snow getting thrown out the chute and you're like, yeah! Well, guess what? Sometimes you're so enamored with the snow that's getting thrown out the chute that you kind of forget what you're doing and where you are in your yard. That's when all of a sudden you watch part of your lawn go out through the chute. That's what happened to me. So today I'm going to teach you how to fix that one spot in your yard by overseeding. Follow me over here. Okay, so I'm going with my snow blower, and the next thing you know, that's where I hit it, right there. So here's what I'm gonna do. This is what I like to do. All right, the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my shovel and I'm going to really soften up that soil right there. All the way on that edge that my snow thrower boogered up there. I'll even get down over here as a little spot so you can hit. Yeah. Okay. So now take a little topsoil out of my bucket here, my topsoil bucket. I'm gonna mix that in as well. Okay. Because I don't want I want this to be at about the same level is everything else. So I'm going to mix that good topsoil in there. Okay, get that area nice and soft so that seed can grow. Now I'm going to take my bucket of seed and I'm just going to spread seed into this area that I just worked on all right okay now I'm gonna do the same thing I'm gonna take this shovel I'm just gonna kind of mix it in there my foot as you can see okay and then I'll take a little bit more of this just some potting soil I have and I'll take some of that potting soil and throw it over the top here protect the seed a little bit Okay. All right. There you have it. Now all you have to do is water it in.
And there you have it. After three weeks and a little tender love and care, my yard is as good as new and you wouldn't even know I hit it with my snowblower. Man 101, you're welcome. <laughs>